Good evening. You guys may be wondering why we are dressed so warmly when it's 85 degrees outside. They might not know. It's 85 degrees here. Yeah. Yeah. It's because we're going to Gaylord Palms Ice tonight. And Gaylord Palms actually did invite us out to experience this so that we could show it to you guys. So the tickets were free for us. Mm -hmm. But we have been here in years past. And I'll, I'll link that uh, those videos down below if you want to check those out too because the theme changes every year Yeah, so it's a different a totally different ice show every year, which is cool. It's very cold in there It is six degrees So we brought all kinds of jackets and hats and scarves and gloves and everything yeah. because last year we were very cold. We were so cold, we only stayed in the room for five minutes. Yeah. Like we we literally, we only spent five minutes in there. Yeah. So I really don't think we got our money's worth last year. So no. this year, I'm, I'm gonna be in there for 10 hours. So yeah, I hope that we are able to stay in there for a little bit longer this year. So let's head inside and do some snow tubing. The theme this year is a Christmas story. So I'm excited to see Ralphie made out of ice. Let's do it. There is so much to do here at Christmas at Gaylord Palms. We heard that the Cirque Dreams show is really good, and there's an escape room, and this Elf on a Shelf character breakfast. Can I just say, I'm already cold, and we haven't even gotten inside yet. So we decided to suit up before going in, and we're not even into the cold area yet. No. We're just into like the inside area that's a little bit cold. It's probably like 65 in here. I feel like Kanye. Why? Well, when he wears like the big, the... You are definitely wearing... It. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> You're definitely what this is one of my jackets. It's a down jacket. It's very nice. And I even have on two pairs of pants. Yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> All right. Let's do it. We're going in now. I feel like um what's uh what's Ralphie's brother's name? That's a good question. The one who falls? Yeah. I'm him. We are inside of the Alpine Village and this is where all of the activities take place. But we are headed over to Ice. Here we go. Heading into Ice. I like this. It doesn't seem like there's a lot of people here right now. We got the chill pass, which kind of puts us to the front of the line. It's like a fast pass, but we're getting our parkas right now. That means we're heading in any moment to the coldness. Getting your parka on. Yeah, look at it. You look all puffy. Wow. <laughs> I feel like you look like the Stay Puffed Marshmallow Man. <laughs> oh, it's nine degrees. I was saying it was six degrees. It's like summertime practically. Why are it's, you wearing all this? I know, right? <laughs> are you ready to head in? It's right there. That's where we're going. All right, gotta get pumped up. Yeah, here we go. We're headed in. Thank you. All right, it is freezing cold in here. Wow! I don't think I was prepared enough. I feel really good, actually. My, I didn't wear any like long underwear underneath my pants. Uh, I wore two pairs of pants. <laughs> I should have done that. I like how they're telling the whole story right there. There it is, my house at good old Cleveland Street. How could I ever forget it? Everything here is made of ice. These trees are made of ice. This entire house is made of ice. No, the ground is not. And also the major award is not, but the car is. Did you win a major award? I did. It's a, I think it's Italian. It said Fragile on the box. Look at this. This is an entire car made out of ice. I want to look in the windows. Can you? Is it clear? Are there something in there? Oh. Can you imagine if you're standing, you like sit down there next to the wheel uh -huh. and you hold out your hands like you're holding a, b a bunch of lug nuts in a hubcap oh. and then you slip and you go, oh, fudge. <laughs> Except I didn't say fudge. There it is. The Holy Grail of Christmas gifts. A Red Rider BB gun. I don't know the whole thing. It's like with a red dot scope <laughs> and a compass so you can tell time in the stock. Here he is with his little glasses. Oh yeah. That's pretty neat. Yeah, I love that. Those are real glasses like on him. Here it is. They're throwing uh, the bad guys. What? I, I need to look up what everybody's names are. Oh, yeah, I can't remember. Because I don't remember. We should have watched this movie before coming here. Oh, there I am. Yeah. That's you. <laughs> a triple dog dare? There's no turning back from a triple dog dare. I will say there was a sign out front that said absolutely no licking the ice. <laughs> there you go. Your tongue might actually get stuck to it. Well, this is kind of interesting. Kind of looks like this person's arm broke at some point and they repaired it. Pretty impressive. I think the most mind boggling part about all this is that all of the buildings and everything are made of ice. There's like electric lights on this ice building. Ooh, we're part of the exhibit now. Oh, there it is. That's the iconic scene. 
Both iconic scenes. Fragile, it must be Italian. They're getting the leg lamp. You can see the disappointment in mom's eyes. <laughs> this is amazing. You can go in there. Look at you. You're part of it. I love that they put the little like quotes in here. Oh, fudge. And the action shot of the lug nuts coming out of the hubcap. Over the years, I got to be quite the connoisseur of soap. Because after he said that, he had to eat a bar of soap. I think the bathtub's made of ice. There's a sink made of ice right here. Wow. I think that this is probably so cool to me because the Christmas story is one of those iconic stories from my childhood that we used to watch every Christmas. And there it is. You'll shoot your eye out. Is that a, a bottle of 99 apples right there? Why? Was that in the movies? I don't know. Did somebody just leave that there? Probably. <laughs> oh no, this is where this steady torrent of obscenities came out of his mouth. And then he started beating him up. That's where he beat up the bully, right? And then here he is hiding underneath the sink after he broke his glasses from getting in the fight with that bully. There is an ice carver in here currently carving something. That's really interesting. Oh my goodness. They have the Santa slide. This is amazing. I wonder if they'll let me go down backwards so I can get that shot from the movie sliding away from Santa. There he is, Santa's kicking me down the slide right now. He said, I'll shoot my eye out. Oh! oh, that was fun. Jen's up at the top waiting to tell Santa what she wants for Christmas. She's gonna ask for a Red Ryder BB gun. I don't know where she's coming out. Oh! This kind of tells a little bit about the people who do the ice carving, what kind of tools they use and stuff like that. It's Christmas morning. We're coming down the stairs. Oh, you look so cute. Go put on the bunny suit, Ralphie. I don't want to be a bunny. He looks like a deranged Easter bunny. He looks like a pink nightmare. I like how they added so many little details here, like their family pictures up here on the wall. Oh my God. I shot my eye out. His glasses are actually broken. He really did shoot his eye out. There's the target that he was shooting at. And there they are, the Bumpus's dogs. Bumpuses! Here they are at the Chinese restaurant. Getting ready to eat the duck. It's smiling at me. The end of the story. Gradually I drifted off to sleep. The end. And then Jesus. They have an entire nativity scene made out of ice. As well as an angel over here. Oh no, did your glasses fog up? No, what are you talking about? Oh no, here goes the camera. You're drifting into the fog. <laughs> what do I do? I don't know. Here's the problem with coming out of the ice exhibit. It's kind of going to be a little bit of time before we can use the camera again. Yeah. Because it fogs up. Here's how they get you. As soon as you get out of the ice cold nine degree ice exhibit, they're like, hey, I got some hot chocolate here for you. What did you think of the ice exhibit? Oh, it was really cool. I had more fun this year because I was properly dressed. Yeah. I think that I was not having a good time last year because I was so incredibly cold. I couldn't even think I was so cold. So this year was perfect. Also, I think that I liked this year's theme better than last year. I think the theme is cool every year, but I really, really did like this theme. Yeah. I thought it was, because it's like a story we all know. I feel like so. I related better to it. Yeah, it was neat. I liked it. Like a little gift shop out here where you can get all kinds of Christmas supplies. And then I think you can meet Santa over there. They have their own ice ornament from Gaylord Palms that lights up. I think this would be a neat thing if you came here every year to get a different one per year for your Christmas tree. And they're $24. Looks like she's not in there right now, but Mrs. Claus has her own little meet and greet area too. Now it's time for a little bit of snow tubing and throwing of snowballs. Something I have never done in my life. So I'm excited for that one. I think we threw snowballs at each other in Utah. Oh yeah, for like a second. Cinematic tube holding shot. One of the slide attendants was just doing a Fortnite dance. Whoa! Oh goodness. Whoa. This is exciting. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Whoa. Oh. 
So we did want to point out that the snow tubing and throwing snowballs are an additional charge. Each one costs an additional charge. Time to throw some snowballs. Oh, they're all preformed and everything for us. Very cold. Oh, you hit that present. I didn't hit it hard enough. Counts. Look, there it is. I think you did it. I think you hit the snow time. I sometimes hit the wall hard enough that the sensor went off. <laughs> you're, I feel like you're pretty good at this. I'm not hitting anything. Oh, you hit that present down. Ooh, okay. Ooh, you hit that present down too. All right, I'm gonna go for the conveyor belt. Okay. Oh, dang, that was the perfect throw. You got one more? The bottom of the barrel is just literally that, the bottom of the <laughs> Ooh, hit, uh, hit that guy on the ladder. Did he do something? I don't know, the question. Ooh, I don't know, you just got, got OSHA called on him. That's what happened. <laughs> Oh, you did it! I did it. I'm gonna hit one of those buttons. Though. Oh, I totally missed. So close. No time. Almost. Oh no, they're all falling apart on you. That was a button. Did you hit it? I totally wasn't even pointing it at the button when you hit it. That was the button. Oh! I made that snow. That's what happened. Oh, nice! I convinced of it. You made the train go off. Yeah, look at you. I kind of like you in your little beanie. You look like a hipster cool kid at like a coffee bar. I feel like I'm trying to rob a kid that's home alone on the holidays. That is what you look like. It's true. What's that guy's name? Mark. No, no, no. The, what's his actual name? I don't know. He's not Danny DeVito, but he's the other one. Kevin McAllister. No, no. No, no. You know, the guy who plays the little guy. Yeah, I know, but I don't know what his name is. He's like Danny DeVito, but... Not any. <laughs> okay, you're no help. There is a full bar over here too. So you can get some beers, wines, mixed drinks, snacks. Oh, there's a giant rocking carousel horse here. We're headed towards the hotel attractions. We're headed towards holiday cheer. Ooh, there's all kinds of stuff this way. A Christmas tree trail. You guys know I love a good Christmas tree trail. This is Harriet the Christmas Dolphin sculpture. Is that true? No. Oh. <laughs> the elf on a shelf, a Christmas tradition. You can take your photo as if you are the elf on a shelf. This is the stage where the Cirque Dreams Unwrapped show is, but off in the distance, look at that Christmas tree. So there you have it. That was our trip to Gaylord Palms and Ice. Mm -hmm. Once again, thank you to Gaylord Palms for having us out. Yeah, thank we had you. A blast. I had more fun this year, like I said before, because I was properly dressed. So I will say it is very, very cold. It's not fun when you're freezing in there. So make sure if you come, you bring enough clothes. It is a little bit strange walking up when it's 84 degrees outside with like 15 layers of clothes on. It's yeah. warm in here. Yeah. Yeah. So all in all, fantastic time. Yeah. I'm glad that it was the Christmas story because I really yeah. like related to that theme. It was cool. And I liked it. I liked it a lot. I really, really liked the snow tubing. They were having fun with it and like spinning us around and that was really cool. And I also really liked that they had the Santa slide in the ice. Yeah area that was like a, just a fun extra so cool yeah. so with that being said we are off we will see you guys tomorrow and now it's time to pay the price <laughs>